More than 120 people have been arrested in eastern Pakistan after a Muslim mob burned churches and homes over blasphemy allegations. Authorities say that two Christians and their family members have fled their homes. A heightened presence of police and security personnel. The mark of an area of Pakistan now on high alert. Authorities warn of a re-eruption of the violence that 24 hours earlier had sent shockwaves across the nation. Burnt out churches and Christian homes, the product of one of the country's most destructive religious mob attacks. Hundreds of Muslims were involved in the vandalism, which included setting scores of homes in a city of Jaranwala on fire. The group accused two members of the Christian community of blasphemy. For me. They had allegedly desecrated pages of the Quran, triggering a wave of anger among Muslims. The group had gathered and rioted before being dispersed by the police. But Muslim residents continued their protests later in the day, this time against the police for not taking their side. The city's Christian colony has been cordoned off and hundreds of police deployed in the area. Dozens of Christians in Karachi also took to the streets to protest against the attacks. یہ ہمارے گھروں کا حال دیکھیں یہ ہمارے چرچوں کا حال دیکھیں ہماری بستی کا حال دیکھیں چلو اگر انہوں نے غلطی کی ہے تو انہیں پکڑے ہمارا قصور کیا ہے ہمارے گھروں کو جلایا گیا ہے ہمیں انصاف چاہیے ہمارے چرچوں کو جلایا گیا ہے انہوں نے ایک غلطی کی ہے ہمارے سارے چرچ جلا دیے گئے ہیں جتنے بھی جڑا والا میں ہیں ہماری بستیوں میں گھر جتنے بھی یہ غریب لوگ کیا کریں اب یہ کہاں پہ رہیں کہاں پہ بیٹھیں جو جتنے بھی گھروں میں سمان تھا سب کچھ جلا دیا ہے The U.S. State Department adding its voice of concern. We are always concerned of incidents of religiously motivated violence. Violence or the threat of violence is never an acceptable form of expression. Local authorities have shut schools and offices and banned rallies for a week to prevent more violence.